Salesforce master table. Now, in Salesforce, we have a master table. Last class, we have discussed about the sales, um, Salesforce CRM architecture and marketing cloud. Now, let's see the master table. So, master table is nothing but in Salesforce, master is nothing but a parent. Master is nothing but a, a parent. So, master table. So master table is nothing but the data does not change. Data does not change usually. Data does not change, but data is used mostly. So example, the patient information. So patient information, we will capture it only one time. But this data will be changed. This data will be used many a time. Like whenever they visit to the hospital, we always use that patient data. But we never change the patient data usually, right? And uh, for example, the customers' information, lead. What are the lead we are capturing from the website? This lead information we capture it only one time, and the data never changes frequently. It might be changed in like every one year or a six months, but it does not change frequently. It does not change frequently, but data is used most frequently. These tables are called as a master tables. Now, example in example, we have a customer master. And second one is product master. In Salesforce, customer master, product master data does not change. Now, what is a customer master here? Customer master is nothing but any interested person. Any interested person. In Salesforce, any interested person, you will capture it in account and contact. We have a two objects which are account and contact. So customer master is nothing but account and contact. Product master is nothing but a product object. Product object. So account is nothing but could be a, any business company information. Account is any business company information or could be a group information or could be a society information or could be a personal information. Contact is nothing but single person information. single person information. So account is a business, company information or a group or a society. Contact is nothing but a single person. Now master tables, account and contacts are linked. Account and contacts are linked each other. Let's take a scenario. The business which we have is, let's take a business uh, that we are going to sell the laptop. Let's say here, Dell company is selling the laptop. So in that case, when the Dell company is selling the laptop, now government of India wants to buy the laptop. That means here account is a government of India. Account is government of India wants to buy a laptop. So they want to buy a laptop, bunch of laptops they wanted to buy. Who is selling this uh, Laptop Dell company is selling the laptop. So government has reached out to the Dell company. And then in the Dell company, now first of all, this is government of India is nothing but a, this is a business, which is nothing but account, which is nothing but a account, which is a government of India. In this government of India, again, it is divided into the multiple teams. Right, so we have a different teams are available. So let's say here we have, assume we have Ministry of Tourism. Ministry of Tourism and then Ministry of Home. Ministry of Finance. There are different groups are there. Now, these groups also a account because this is a group. 
which contains the multiple the multiple people are working in this group. So this is also group. Now in this group, each group, like a Ministry of Tourism, Ministry of Home, Ministry of Finance, every group, there is a certain people are working on it. So let's say in the Ministry of Tourism, there is a person who is working, let's say Arvind Singh. Arvind Singh who is working on the Ministry of Tourism. And also there is a, below this, there is a one more person, right? So this assume that this person is working here. Now below that one more person is reporting to this person. So let's take a Vardhan Rao. Right? Now here what is happening? Vardhan Rao is reporting to the Arvind Singh. Arvind Singh is part of the Ministry of Tourism. And Ministry of Tourism is part of the government. So the cycle here, it is a single contact. This is single person detail is nothing but a contact. These two are contact information. So contact is connected to the account. So the structure will be in Salesforce account. Account is one object. And this account object will be connected to the multiple contacts. Again, this contact might be having a below one more contact might be there. So the connection will be contact to contact and contact will be connected to the multiple contact is connected to the account. So account will be connected multiple contacts. Let's say this is contact one and this is contact two and contact three. Now, account contacts are common objects in sales. These are the master tables. And these master tables are common for either which are the cloud you go for it, these master tables definitely will be there. Because every business, every cloud needs a contact information, person information. They need a business information. They need a group of information. That's the reason master table is part of every cloud. Now, where can you see the master tables in Salesforce? Let's go and see. Now, let's say here. Let's duplicate and go to the application. Now, in Marketing Cloud, you will be able to see the contact as well as the account. If you try to open the account, you will be able to see. Right. Similarly, in the Sales Cloud also, you have it. If you open the Sales Cloud, you will be able to see the account and contact. So, account and contacts are master tables. And these master tables are part of every cloud. And... In Salesforce, Marketing Cloud has a campaign and lead that we have discussed yesterday. Now, can I can I not access those objects in the Sales Cloud or Service Cloud? There is a no restriction. You can access those objects from anywhere. There is a no restriction at all. But the flow is involved with campaign and lead. Now, here in Sales Cloud also, you can see account and contact. Let's say I'm going to create an account here. So, I'm creating the account. Government of India. Rating, let's say it's a one. And account number is GOB120. And type is prospect industry is let's say government. And click on this is account. Right, and again, I'm going to create a one more account. So, in order to create a one more account, go to the here and click on the new button. Again, I'm creating the Ministry of Tourism. Now, here it says parent account. That means this is an account, but this Ministry of Tourism is 
linked to any other account. Yes, it is linked to the government of India. So parent account is nothing but a same object. We are in same object, but I want to link to the another record within the same object. Another record within the same object. So government of India and rating, let's say one and let's say MP001. And industry is government. One, now, if you open the account, now in the account, you will see something called as a hierarchy. There is a hierarchy is available. Now, if you click on this hierarchy, you will know the flow of account. That means I have a parent account. Inside the parent account, there is a child account. So you will be able to see what is the structure of or what is the hierarchy of this account. Similarly, in the contact also, you will be able to see, right? So this is account hierarchy. What is the parent and how many chairs are there? This is linked to the single account and this hierarchy is only going to show related to the account. It does not show the contact hierarchy here. This is only account hierarchy. Right? This is only account hierarchy. Now let's say I'm going to create contact. Now here, contact, click on a new button, let's say Mr. Arvind Singh, let's take an account name, so which account, what is the group from this person is part of which group, this person is part of which business, he is part of a Ministry of Tourism. I cannot give the government of India because Arvind Singh is reports to Ministry of, he is a part of a Ministry of Tourism. And Ministry of Tourism is a part of government of India. So he is part of this account. Now you can take a depart, mobile number, department, department is tourism. And one say. Now this is contact record. Similarly, I'm going to create a, another record. Click on new. Now another record is, let's say, Vardhan Rao. Vardhan Rao. And this person is also part of Ministry of Tourism. But Vardhan Rao is reports to Arvind Singh. Vardhan Rao is report to Arvind Singh. Now, where can I link? If you scroll down, there is an option here, reports to. If you check this, reports to, it will show you the, the contact record. Here it is, contact record. Now, this is what I'm doing. I'm linking the contact record here. This is contact record, reports to. Same object, contact, which record? This particular person, Vartan Rao, is report to Arvind Singh. Now here on top, this is the account details. This is account detail. Which business whom, whom this person is reports to. Now click on save. Now on the contact also, you have a hierarchy. Now if you click on this hierarchy, you will be able to see the contact hierarchy. Now Arvind Singh is report to the account, right? So he reports to the Ministry of Tourism. It does not show you the Ministry of Tourism hierarchy also. It will show only the contact related. What is the contact? Is this contact has any child? And what is the current contact? And does it report to anybody else? Right. So currently we are into the Vartan Rao and reports to Arvind Singh. This is a hierarchy. And these both are connected to the account which is called as a Ministry of Tourism. Similarly, I can create a Ministry of Home, Ministry of Finance, right? So whoever is reports to this account, I need to create a different contact. Okay. To take an assignment, let's take an example here. Like a, you have a Reliance Industry Company. Reliance Industry Company is a, it's a business. It's a 
business. So when it is we say business, nothing but it's an account. And also in the Reliance Industry Company, we have a different type of a groups. Like a banking is there, footwear is there, supermarket, they have a different groups are there. So these all are accounts. That means these are the group of group or society, group of uh, business, different businesses are there. This is the main business related industry company and in that they have a subgroups. Now th these subgroups are also part of the account. So when you create an account, link the parent to the Reliance industry company. In this banking, assume that there are two people are working and Reliance put where one person is working on it and here two members are working on it. So here we are talking about the person information. Whenever we are talking about the person information, it's a contact details. It's a contact details. So create a contact and link to the related account here. Now, this is contact. Now, within this contact also, if there are another members who are reports to this contact, let's say here Taylor and Jack, both are reporting to the Manoj. So that means they have to create another contact here. Another two contacts I need to create it and give the relate to Manoj. Whatever the Manoj contact is there, give the relate to Manoj contact. So this is the assignment. You guys have to do it. So you just need to create it. A records in the account and contact. Now let's take another assignment, which is a cinema. Cinema is a business, right? So you need to create an account here. Within the cinema, we have a different groups are there. Hollywood, Bollywood, Tollywood. So this is also account. Within the Hollywood, who are people are working on it? Within the Bollywood, who are people are working on it? Within the Tollywood, who are people are working on it? These are the contacts. Now this is contact which is pointing to the related account. And in the Bollywood or in the Tollywood, if there are any chairs are there, that means these people are pointing to somebody else. That means create another contact and link to this person. Link to the related person. This one is a sales force. Sales force is a business, automobile. Right? Automobile is a business. It has to be created in the account. Now in the automobile, we have a different type of a business software. BMW, Volkswagen, Skoda. These are the different type of small business. So this is also account. In BMW, who are working on it? This is a contact. And in Volkswagen, who is working on it? This is a contact. Similarly, in Skoda, who is working on it? So this is also contact. So here we'll have a contact. And if there are any child contact, create a separate contact and link to this contact. And whatever these contacts are there, so this contact has to be linked to the account. This is another assignment and I have also provided the referral link where I have explained clearly. This is about the master table in Salesforce.